What is going on everybody? Hope you guys are doing great. In today's video, we're going to go ahead and take a look at my helmet and the setup that I have for my GoPro communication devices that I use and everything else in between. I'll go ahead and include all the links to the equipment that I use for my helmet in the description box below. Don't forget to drop a like. I appreciate you guys watching the video and let's go ahead and check out the helmet. First thing we'll talk about is the actual helmet. The helmet that I have is the Bell Solid Matte Black Qualifier Full Face Helmet. When I bought the motorcycle, I actually negotiated the helmet, gloves, and jacket in for free when I bought the motorcycle. So they didn't give me the greatest helmet, obviously. It's about a $100 retail value, but luckily I haven't had to use it yet. Knock on wood somewhere now like i said in the description it is a matte black helmet but as you can see i put stickers all over it i've had the helmet for about two years and i kind of got bored of the matte black with the tinted visor look so instead of buying a brand new helmet for 500 or thousand dollars or however much they cost i figured the cheapest and easiest way to give the helmet a new look would just be to sticker bomb it. So I bought a pack of 100 stickers on Amazon for about six bucks and um, without any type of order, I just threw stickers on there. And the stickers, as you can tell, are, you know, Star Wars and other pop culture references. So I dig it, you know, it'll do for now until I buy a new helmet. The next thing that I have is the uh, Sina or Senna, however you like to pronounce it, 20S. It's a Bluetooth communication device that you pair with your phone to be able to not only listen to music, but you'll also be able to receive incoming phone calls and of course make outgoing phone calls as well quality is very crystal clear most people when they call me don't realize that I'm actually on my motorcycle that's how quiet it is when they hear it on their end not only can you pair it with your phone it also has the intercom feature that you can pair up to eight other devices with other riders so you can go riding with up to eight other people and be able to communicate with everybody without having to do any hand signals or gestures or anything like that. The microphone of the Cena is attached to the actual Cena right here. It comes with a clip, so you'll be able to clip it right to the side of your helmet. And the Cena microphone goes right under here into your helmet. Here is the actual, this is the actual Cena microphone right here. This is the microphone that I have set up for the GoPro that I'll talk about in just a second. But the Cena microphone has a sturdy arm, so it's not flailing about, and you don't have to tape it to the inside of your helmet which is pretty dope it also comes with audio commands now I haven't taken the time to learn all the audio commands I find it just easier to toggle the actual device to be able to skip songs or receive phone calls so this is the Sona 20s I absolutely love it I love the Bluetooth technology um, and um, yeah cool the GoPro that I'm using is the GoPro Hero 7 Black. I have it mounted on the front of the helmet just because I like that POV look better than I do the side mounted view. So I have it set up here with just regular GoPro clips that I put double-sided 3M tape just behind just to make sure, give it a little bit more security, I guess. Here, I'll show you. You can't see my hand, but I'm holding it by the GoPro and it's not even budging. Now with any GoPro, because they obviously need to make more money, God forbid they go struggling, you need to buy a GoPro adapter. This is the GoPro adapter that you have to buy if you want to plug in an external mic. Most people mount the adapter to the side, maybe, you know, somewhere around here and just put double-sided tape on it. But I figured that this clamp will actually work. So I actually have it set up right behind the GoPro. And then when you close the GoPro, it's pinched in. It's pinched in right behind the GoPro and it doesn't move. And then I have the external mic plugged in right to the adapter. The external mic that I'm using is called the Purple Panda that I saw in Chase's Two Wheels' this video, so I went ahead and got that. I have it um, running through the inside of the helmet going all the way around and then it comes out right behind over here and like I said before instead of having to tape it or you know glue it to the inside of the helmet it comes with this little clip right here so I just clipped it on to the sturdy Cena microphone without having to tape anything on the inside the dead cat definitely helps with rim uh, with wind reduction noise when you're on the highway or even when you're just putting around so uh, it's been a great, great 
help. So there it is. There's my helmet. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to drop a like or subscribe to the channel. That would be tremendously helpful. Like I said, I'll include all the links in the description box below. I appreciate you guys watching and I'll see you guys later.